right, you guys. Just wanted to make a quick video here. I'm super excited about this one. So, as you can see, Purple Haze is up on the lift. We're going to get ready to do some work to this bike. I'm going to completely redo this bike. As you can see here, it has wide glide triple trees. When I purchased this bike, the older gentleman who owned it said the bike had too much power. So he had to put a wide glide front end on it. So this is a 2000 FXDX. We are going to take this front end off. We're going to put narrow glide trees on this bike. We're going to bring it back to how it should be. I got some risers coming for it off of one of my buddies. I got a set of mid controls so this garbage is getting thrown away. It'll be gone. So all the forward controls are coming off mid glide front end is coming on gonna delete the gauge cluster not gonna be running a speedo or attack at all we don't need it for what this bike is gonna be set up to do uh, got risers and bars coming in for it so we're gonna get this thing to where it should be uh, also gonna tear this cam chest open we're gonna go in we're gonna change the shoes uh, the cam chain tensioner shoes we're gonna change them out we're going to go over this entire bike. We're going to get it set up. I'll probably be throwing some rear shocks on it. I'm not sure because this did come with the factory fully adjustable shocks. So it's going to be a good project here. We're going to get rid of this fat boy headlight. We're going to get rid of this fat boy fender. We're going to get rid of these wide glides. We're going to bring her back to a narrow glide. And I want to start taking this bike out and uh, actually learning on it and having some fun. So I got the 2020 Lowrider S. I don't really want to stunt ride that bike because I have too much money into it. Uh, I know people are going to make fun of me. That's cool. But that bike is my daily cruiser. This is going to be a project here. I'm also looking at getting a touring bike, a road glide. And I want to start doing some work to that, but <clears throat> did a once over on this bike, looked at it. It has adjustable push rods on it. It has aftermarket uh, lifter covers on it. So we're going to tear this open. I want to see what kind of cams are in it. I want to see what's going on there. Going to adjust the clutch on this. Uh, probably going to put a different clutch lever on it. Uh, I have to reseat the bead on the rear tire. Uh, it will not hold air for some reason, so I'm going to do that here in a couple minutes, but I'm going to spare you guys. I'm going to spare you guys the boringness of watching that. So I hit up one of my buddies and he was able to hook me up with the narrow glide trees so i gotta i gotta clean up clean up these a little bit and these are what's gonna go on so i got the narrow glides gonna run a different style headlight i uh, got my mid controls got my adjustable shift linkage coming in the mail it'll be here saturday so I'll throw some more uh, videos up here. Got some, some really nice mids for this bike. And he threw me an axle too. So we're going to tear this thing apart. I'm going to re-grease these bearings. We're going to get this thing rolling. And uh, hopefully less than a month you guys are going to see this bike up and ripping. Uh, that's my time limit for it. I want to get this one up and running in about a month. Uh, had another buddy who was interested in buying this bike. Uh, if he does, I'll let him know the prices once I get done with this thing. But right now, get this bike to where it should have been. I want to bring it back to how it came from the factory with some different upgrades. I'm going to put some different uh, foot pegs on it. I'm going to do some different controls that way. I want to get some MX pegs on here. I want to get this bike set up. I want this bike to be ripping. So this is a great platform for a build. Absolutely amazing bike. 21,000 original miles on this bike. And 
it needs some TLC so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna build it up and my one buddy did say he wants to buy it but depending on what I do to this bike I might not be selling it I want to take this exhaust off I want to run a two in the one on here want to get this air cleaner off run a different air cleaner uh, or at least put a K and N filter on it so we're definitely going to start tearing her apart and I'll show you guys every update along the way so if I do go out and ride here the videos will be on the low rider s but as soon as this bike is up and running there's going to be a lot of footage on this one because I'm super excited about this bike I've wanted another Dyna since I got into my accident and this is going to be the one you guys so we're going to totally transform this bike here and if my buddy does not buy this bike off me in the fall if I get up to 10,000 subscribers on YouTube I am going to raffle this bike off to one of the subscribers so be ready and stay tuned there's going to be a lot of good stuff coming I just wanted to get some content out there. I wanted you guys to see this bike. She is absolutely gorgeous and just needs some TLC. And hopefully the next time you guys see this bike, it's torn apart and getting rebuilt. And then after that, you'll see this bike in some parking lots. I'm gonna be doing some footage on it. I wanna show you guys me, my journey here, learning on this bike and this is, uh, one of the best slates to start building on so we're going to start ripping her apart and we'll update you guys and we'll keep you informed here going forward but just know that there is a lot going to be coming here in the future and once i get these parts off if anybody's looking for some wide glide trees some um, forward controls a fat boy fender a fat boy headlight let me know because uh i will let this stuff go dirt cheap Alright you guys, well that's it for me. I'm going to start working on getting this rear tire beaded and I'm going to start tearing this front end apart. So I'll see you guys later on. If you like this video, uh, go ahead and like and subscribe. I'd like to get some numbers up here and eventually I'll start raffling off some bikes if I get some numbers up here high enough. So, Alright you guys.